Hello students, our today's topic is velocity. In our previous video, we learned that speed decides how fast an object moves. In the racing, speed of the player decides the winner. But the games like a football, the success of a goalkeeper depends upon how fast he changes his position towards the direction of a ball. The tennis player needs to change his position in the direction of the ball so he can hit the ball. In cricket, the fielder has to change his position towards the ball. How fast an object changes its position in a given direction is known as velocity. Velocity hence depends upon magnitude and direction. Velocity is a vector quantity. Magnitude of velocity is equal to change in position upon time required to change the position. Change in position is displacement. To understand the concept of velocity, you should have the knowledge of a displacement. So I suggest you students watch my previous video based on the displacement topic. Magnitude of velocity is equal to displacement upon time. To understand the concept, let's take an example. A batsman hits a ball that remains in air for 5 seconds and it will hit the ground 20 meters away from a filter. How fast the filter should run if he has to catch the ball just before it hits the ground? Represent the situation pictorially. A batsman hit a ball that remained in air for 5 seconds and it will hit the ground 20 meters away from a filter. This is the initial position of the filter. This is the final position of the filter. To catch the ball, the filter has to change his position towards the ball. Displacement of the filter is 20 meter in 5 seconds. Magnitude of velocity is equal to displacement upon time equal to 20 meter upon 5 seconds. Magnitude of velocity is comes out to be 4 meter per second. But we already learned that the velocity depends upon magnitude and direction. So what is the direction of the velocity? Direction of velocity is the direction in which the filter is moved. Let's take one more example. A rocket moved from point A to B covers 36,000 km distance in 12 hours. Velocity of the rocket is equal to displacement upon time. When I mention velocity, it represents magnitude of velocity. Velocity is equal to 36,000 km upon 12 r. Therefore, magnitude of the velocity is equal to 3,000 km per r. Velocity of the rocket is 3,000 km per r in the direction of the rocket's motion. In these pictures, objects are moving along straight path in one direction. We already learned that when objects move along in one direction, distance covered by an object is equal to its displacement. Hence, the speed of the object is equal to magnitude of velocity. Therefore, velocity can also be defined as the speed at which an object moves in one direction. From all the discussion, we learned that Velocity decides how fast an object moves in one direction. Now students, exercise for you. An object moves from A to B along a circular path of radius 7 meter in 0.2 seconds. What is the speed and the velocity of the object? Verify if the speed is equal to magnitude of velocity. If not, why? 
answer in the comment box. Students, do like, share and subscribe my channel.